Hey, what's up everybody and welcome back to the channel and a little bit more Team Yankee for you. We're taking a look at the mech platoon for the Iraqis today, so we'll get this open for you in just a sec, get it all sorted out, and show you everything that you can uh, basically field out of that. So we'll be right back. Alrighty guys, got everything sorted out here for you. So you basically get seven bases out of this, and as we can see from the little description here, so we're going to get four AK-47 uh, assault rifle teams and then three RPG-7 anti-tank teams. So give you a little bit of punch to deal with enemy vehicles, um, and of course uh, the AK-47 teams will do work on uh, enemy infantry. So um, there's basically everything that you get. Um, try to get this sorted out as nicely as possible. Um, so various AK-47 uh, guys here, um, different poses. Looks like there's even a couple of LMGs or maybe even heavy machine guns here. Um, and then a couple guys basically like carrying pistols or otherwise acting like officer figures. So uh, pretty easy to put those on the base there. And of course, four of the, or sorry, three of those will uh, essentially be used on the um, uh, RPG team bases. And then speaking of the RPGs, so we get those there. So plenty of uh, firepower here for what it is. So a nice small pickup, an easy little base uh, or easy little uh, blister to basically get and punt or uh, uh, increase those uh, infantry forces that you have and sort of pad out the unit sizes. So a little bit of cleanup work, of course. Uh, these are not the plastics, obviously, so the older metal. So got a little bit of flash here and there, a little bit of filing work to get done and um, get these guys ready. But um, pretty simple pickup overall. Again, gives you a decent little chunk to add to your Iraqi mech platoons. Of course, um, uh, Iraqis are uh, going to field more in the, uh, the quantity than the quality department. So um, depending on how many of these you run and uh, just, you know, how much, uh, uh, like, you know, if you're running like a mech company or something like that, um, you know, you're going to have uh, quite a few of these. And obviously, um, going to need some BMPs and stuff to back them up with and uh, move them around in. So, um so uh, just one of these, of course, is uh, likely not going to cut it for you. So you might end up getting several of these. And um, there are some other boxes out there and blisters that uh, can supplement that. So there's a, like a mech company weapons blister, which we'll have a video for here shortly, um, and some other uh, things here. So if we flip over, we can kind of get an idea of some of these here. Right, so the mech platoon is what we just uh, are looking at right now. Uh, mech company, on the other hand, will give you 55 figures. So um, really, that's probably where you should start if you're going to go um, mech infantry with the Iraqis. The platoons, of course, are just a nice way to sort of pad those out like we were talking about here. And then the weapons um, to give you, again, uh, more of those um, specialized weapons that... Um, uh, you wouldn't necessarily get enough of or um, all that you want in like the company or the platoon here so um overall pretty nice again these are all going to be metal um no plastic infantry as far as we know for the iraqis but um again nice little pickup here and uh, you know we'll uh have quite a few of the infantry here for the iraqis as we work on building our force but let us know in the comments guys where you are at with uh iraqi infantry do you feel like um that's a viable um part of the army uh do you focus more on vehicles whether it's like various flavors of tank companies or um you know, do you focus more on like uh, true combined arms, other things like that? So what uh, what do you really focus on for the Iraqis? What do you think works? What do you think, uh, where do you think they struggle? Uh, let us know in the comments, guys. Be happy to hear from you. Um, hit us up with a like and subscribe too if you could. Um, that just helps keep the channel growing. And we will have a lot more Team Yankee content rolling your guys' way here pretty regularly as we work on building our force and um, getting them, uh, both our forces. So we got West Germans and Iraqis here. Uh, getting both fully painted up and getting some battle reports for you guys. So uh, thanks so much for stopping in, guys. Thanks for hanging out, and we will see you in the next one.